so big. How 
thick I want to make this batter. Maybe thicker? Like I kind of like a thick batter. This consistency is pretty good. Yeah. Makes fish and chips during camp. <laughs> we do! How long did this all take? Let's see what time today. Cheers! Cheers! Mmm. That batter. Mm -hmm. Pretty good batter. Perfectly salted too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Even without the tartar. Wow. Oh, it's so hot. Mm. Mm. I like the garlic flavor. Mm hmm. And the chips. just snuggled in here. Wa is cleaning up. It's too cold for me to be outside, so I am just in this nice, warm, big sleeping bag. We finally have neighbors. We thought we weren't gonna have neighbors. I have to whisper. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Yeah, the 17-year-old old grandma is still camping. <laughs> She's doing well. She's been very active lately for her age. You okay? So I recently got this diesel heater and I tried it one time at home. So yeah, I'm trying it out for the first time tonight in real camping and Whaley said it's really warm inside. I felt it. It feels really good. I hope that this will make us go camping a little more basically. Somewhere in like the low 40s right now um, and it feels not too bad. It's doable. So this is making it super comfortable, but if it's any colder than that, it would be no problem having this diesel heater. So that right there is a heater and it has about a one gallon diesel tank in there. And then that's my Go Zero uh, 500X that's powering it. Uh, this should last me about two, two nights or one full day. I tried it on last time at home for about eight hours. It was running and it used about 40% of the battery. So I'm guessing it would give me about 16 hours of use. 
we are running it through this um i guess makeshift system that i have it's just a piece of cardboard to keep the heat away from all our tent stuff but in the future i think i'm gonna make something a lot nicer than that uh, i think once i have a good system then i'll show you guys what i make with it so now all we gotta do is shut the doors a little more so that the heat doesn't escape and it'll be nice having the ventilation at the bottom and then we also have a carbon monoxide detector inside just in case and then i got my fire extinguisher in case we might need that also <laughs> I lost a good chunk of hair like this much. <laughs> I wish it was recorded. I know. My dad used to always buy this. Is it from Hong Kong? It's Taiwan. <laughs> <laughs> I know I brought it. You want to see how I brought it? I put it in a water bottle and I was like, okay, that's too big. So I squeezed it. But yeah? What? I saw this bottle earlier. You didn't know what it was. Huh? are pretty good very sweet though very sweet yeah, it's sure. called a sweet touch if it was like 50% less sweet it'll be amazing they are so juicy <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> what if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars mm -hmm. Maybe the birds will sing about your heart Maybe the trees will whisper the word Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope
Ha, ha, ha.